that should be much more about community building than about products. Challenge for banks is how can they keep up and continue to meet customer needs. Here are some looks behind the scenes of the Fintech Week in Amsterdam, where I had the honor to do the opening keynote with Don Ginzel. The conference, you really could see the mature ecosystem and a lot of service providers all trying to improve banking. What is the biggest threat in fintech currently? I think we're a little bit at a standstill and there is not just one big trend. I think everybody is trying to see what is the next thing. Diversifying the workspace to make sure that your products, your services and your end customer is happy as well as their needs are met. Everyone's talking about open banking still, right? And RegTag and APIs and security and everyone keeps on going at it. Uh, well, actually what I think the biggest things are, I would say embedded finance. I think it's really, because what it actually means for me is that it becomes invisible, right? And I think it's really uh, one of the sort of the, the splits where much of the industry is just really trying to still, you know, get in touch with their customers, want to talk to them live, in person, get them to their branch office. Uh, and finally, I think with embedded finance, they really begin to realize that they should actually be part of another supply chain where someone else is talking to the customer and they just provide one of the components to actually make it work. Key drivers to continue the digitalization of the whole world around us and likewise affecting banks that still need to keep up one of the last sectors to uh, digitize and on the back of the digitalization you see the ecosystem changing as you see here today new types of players technology players um, banking is opening up becoming uh, more open embedded and it changes how banks interact with the customer integrate investments uh, into our offering and to make it more like a habit of everyday interactions. I mean, why educate the users that they would not use just investment as a part of uh, or a form of gambling, but they would really do it consciously, but in small. That there's a lot of disruptive new technology, new startups that have great innovations for corporates to, to use and corporates want to use it because their customers are asking for it. But what that means is there's a high dependency on these small companies and there's a lot of risk. And that risk needs to be caught, needs to be hedged against. What a well-made conference. Are we going to meet there next year?